Howdy folks, it's Mickey here, and welcome back to Let's Play Machinarium. In the last part, we finished the band, so now they can play their music peacefully. And uh, we also got our oil can, and we also got a broken radio. So we're going to try to fix that radio, and in the meantime, we're also going to give the oil can back to the, um, the you know, the old man up here. So let's just walk back up here. Um, remember this this part of the game will come in handy later on. Um, it's mainly used for backtracking, but whatever. Okay, let's go talk to the old man before we do anything, because uh, because we need to, because we're good old people from the community. Okay, <coughs> here you go. Yeah, put it on your foot. Oh yeah, put it on that wheel. Oh, cool. A awesome. Oh, I now I need sunflower oil. Okay, we'll get into that later. Um, can we move this manhole? Yes, we can. We're not gonna jump down it quite yet. Okay. Um, first thing you're gonna want to do is you're gonna want to go down into this handle, <coughs> and you're gonna want to take the handle out. And let's walk over here to this lady. Now let's put that in. Okay, well, let's talk to this girl now. I want it to be infinite. So, I don't know. We gotta... Let's look at the notes here. Okay, there's that little sign. And... Okay, that we gotta get to hourglass sign and seven. So, let's turn this crank. And as you can tell, up here, the crank turns uh, time. So, let's turn it to... Um... <coughs> Okay, we got on the hourglass, so let's change, put it onto seven. There we go. <coughs> and now the lady is walking inside. Awesome. Okay, so let's see what this note behind her says. Uh. Okay. So the squiggly sign, or kind of like an air sign, and six. Okay. So let's let's get that going. Oh, this part is actually quite um, tiresome. Um, just turning it. The game. This is not the only part of the game that has the turn mechanics, but whatever. Okay, let's get it to six. There we go. <coughs> Sorry. Excuse me if I cough and stuff. Still got a cold. And now that we did that. <coughs> This old pilgrim guy starts walking downstairs. So what is he gonna do now? Hmm. Oh, he says he just walks inside. He's like, I don't care. I don't care if I'm doing business or whatever. Okay, so let's walk upstairs now that he's not up there anymore. So, and is there anything we can do up here? Yes, we can grab the megaphone. Oh boy. And I guess you guys can kind of tell. With the megaphone in the radio, you get a finished radio. So let's go back downstairs now. And... Can, ooh, Joseph slides down the rail like a boss. Okay, let's go down this sewer hole. Or manhole. And the first thing you'll notice now in this new area is that there is... Uh, like a dangly hook. Uh, a wrench. A ladder. Um... A table and a guy. So let's go talk to this guy. What does he have to say? Okay, we want to unscrew this, apparently, I don't know why. And he's like, oh no, I had music playing, and then suddenly that, oh, that how does he, he's hanging upside down and he still has his hat on. I don't, I don't understand this game's logic. But what is he doing? Is he gonna unplug it? Oh no, he just puts it in a giant bag, like he's Santa Claus. He's the Grinch. <laughs> okay, so, now what? And he says, um, work equals music. So we need music to play, I guess? Okay, before we do anything, before we give him music, we're going to want to, we're going to want to, we're going to want to work on this, um, puzzle thing here. Okay, you can get three wrenches as it says. We're gonna want to put a wrench there. Now let's go get the other wrenches. Um, one wrench is over 
down here. And if you look down through here, you'll notice that's where the Black Cat Brotherhood are. So, <clears throat> that's where that guy's, like, stereo, or, um, radio thing is. Um, the wrench guys. And if you look down here, you can see there's a wrench. And if we use the thing that we just grab, this kind of hook thing, we can, <coughs> excuse me, we can grab the wrench. So, we have two out of the three wrenches. That's pretty cool. And, let's go up here. Let's go in, let's look in this cupboard. Oh, it's a book. Okay, let's turn the pages. Uh, just useless contraptions. Uh, yeah, just useless contraptions. Ooh, there's a car. Oh, and there's a tower. But that's not the tower we're going to. And there's the wrench. Awesome. Let's put the book back. <clears throat> now that we have all three wrenches, let's work on this puzzle here. Okay, if you put a wrench here, and then I believe a wrench there. Yeah, that stops all of them. Or, well, let's see if what happens if we put there. Nothing? Okay, pretty sure that's where you're supposed to do. You're supposed to put one, two, there. Okay, let's go give that guy a radio now. And let's see what we can do with that. Yeah, plug it in. Oh, yeah. <coughs> Look at that guy. He's having a fun time. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, Joseph. Look at you. You manly man. Carrying that wrench guy. Yeah, let's turn this thing. Yeah, and all that water is dumping down. Awesome. Awesome. <laughs> Silly them. Who do they think they are? Okay, we kind of drowned them, but they're robots. I don't know why they're not getting electrocuted, but whatever. <laughs> Silly robots. Tricks are for kids. <laughs> oh, yeah. We're not going to listen to this song. This song is just on an endless loop. Kind of like this. It's like... Actually, um... Yeah, that should be it for now. Okay. Let's see what that did. That was kind of right under us, so let's see if we can walk down here. Oh, we can! Okay, we're going to get into um, the next area of the game, which is through this little um, door thing right here. So I will see you guys in the next episode.